Hey everybody, Frozen Blaze here from Super Sibs Gaming coming at you with yet another Super Sibs Gaming tutorial. This video will be focused on how to get your Minecraft Forge to work with the new Java 8 update. So if you've updated to Java 8 and your Minecraft Forge is not running, watch the following video to see how to fix it without a patch. This tutorial is going to be kind of quick, um, a little simple tutorial. A lot of people are complaining about how they can't play Minecraft on any type of Forge now, now that they got the Java 8 update. So I'm just going to go through how you can still use Minecraft Forge without uh, any kind of a uh, patch or anything like that, because I know for like a block the patch wasn't working so I had to figure out a way to make it so that he could still use uh, Minecraft Forge. So this is what we're gonna do. So let's run Minecraft and let me show you how what you're gonna have to do. I already fixed it for him so uh, I'm not gonna it's not gonna not run it's gonna run but I want to show you what I did. So a simple a simple fix would really be to just downgrade back to Java 7. But for me, that's kind of like a security risk, so I wasn't going to do that. So what I did is I I did re-download Java 7 for like a block, but I didn't I didn't keep it so that he doesn't also have Java 8. So he has Java 8 at the moment and he has Java 7. So what I did is I downloaded that. I'll put the link in the description below. I'll put the download for both Windows and Mac uh, Java 7 in the, in the description below so you can download that. But I'm going to show you what I did quickly just so that he could be able to play Minecraft 1.6.4, Forge, whatever, or any other Forges. So go to whatever your Forge profile is, go to edit, and you want to make sure this file is uh, selected because usually that file is not selected and it just... So it just runs the most recent Java that you have. So normally, normally it'll look like this when you when you select the executable executable file. It'll normally come up with this where it says JRE 1.8.0 um, underscore 25, and that is Java 8 update 25. Okay. So I wanted it to execute Java 7, so I made sure that I made this exe executable file where Java 7 would be used instead of what it was, which was Java 8. So I'm going to show you how to get that. So once you download Java and you install it onto your computer, on the Windows, it will... Oh, sorry. Uh, on the Windows, you're going to go to Program Files and it could be in the x68 x86 or just be in pro program files wherever that is for you basically where your java is and we're going to control we're going to copy that so control c so i could just get to it quicker um so you see here now this is the java folder and i have the most recent java 8 update the and i have the Java 7, the last one. So let me go through that with how you would get it. If you didn't have that link, you would simply go to Windows, the, the C, and you would go to either Program Files or Program Files x86. It's under the Program Files times 86 for me. So then you're going to select Java, and then you have this. So now what you want to do is, after you download Java 7 and install it, you're going to copy the name of this file and you're going to swap it in for where it says GRE JRE sorry where it says JRE 1.8 whatever okay so I'm just gonna put that there and then you're gonna make sure that's checked and then click save profile and once you do that you should be able to um, it, it should be it should load it might crash actually because I know that like a block has is working on a mod pack at the moment, so uh, some of the mods aren't working with each other, so they made the thing crash. But let's see, maybe it'll work, and it'll load up. So after this, you'll be fine. 
if you have, again, like I said, if you have any questions, um, comment below and I'll try to figure it out for you. For Mac users, you're simply going to do the same thing. You're just going to swap out the file name. Um, Mac users, I know that s if you didn't delete Windows 7 from your computer, it'll still be there, so it'll still run. Because with me, I did update to Windows 8. I, I mean, I did update to Java 8, and I still had Java 7 on my computer, so it still was executing it as Java 7. So that's why... Um, it still works. So as you can see, it loaded Minecraft 1.6.4 on the Forge, uh, Minecraft Forge 9.11.1.9.6.5. This will work for all the forges, however, so any forge you want to use, you just swap that little name of the file out and it'll execute it as Windows, it'll execute it with J Java 7. So you'll be fine. Uh, I hope this tutorial was helpful for you. Uh, please remember to leave a rate, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'm um, coming to you every t Tuesday with a tutorial. Take care. Bye-bye. You do the same thing to the bottom screen. Come on!